So what is good, everyone? Today, we're going to be continuing our theme of playing really good old wrestling games. And today, we're not just playing any really good old wrestling game. We're playing the definitive edition of SmackDown Here Comes the Pain. The definitive edition was created by none other than Scott J. I'll have his link in the description. He makes definitive editions of a bunch of old wrestling games and even Dragon Ball Z games where he adds in uh, assets, characters, attires, arenas that were taken out of the final build of the game. Also, I should mention the screen behind me is not the definitive edition. That is not what we're playing. That is just for B-roll. So it's only right that we take my boy Jeff Hardy, who was originally missing from this game, if I need to say it again, and not only put him in season mode, we're gonna be taking the strap off the champ, which is, we either going, I don't know, man, I think we're gonna go to Raw. But we're gonna be, let's, let's see who's all on the roster right now. What show Jeff on? Jeff should be on Raw. Yep, I'm on Raw, but what I wanna do to make this a little more interesting, we're gonna make we're gonna make Raw, we're gonna make the flagship show unmess withable. We bring it, we switch in Brock with the uh, I don't want to move Flair because of Evolution. We switch in Brock for Lance Storm. Chuck Palumbo is also gonna be getting switched off of the brand for uh, X Pac. Scotty Too Hotty is going to be getting switched off. We're going to take Cena. We're going to take Cena. I don't want to take all of their heavy hitters because who's going to end up? We're going to have Lance Storm end up as the, the WWE champion, bro. So starting out, we're going to have Jeff Hardy at a 75 overall. WWE legend Jeff Hardy. Let's get it. I'm sure we've all seen this. Here comes the pain intro monologue a million times. I'm gonna get copyrighted for this. What, Bischoff? Hey, Jeff. As you probably know, I'm the GM of Raw. Don't let the pressure get to you, and welcome to Monday Night Raw. So for our first match, we're gonna be squaring off against Bubba Ray Dudley. Oh, this is when they had that Okay, Bubba. Man, we can play this. We can play this. Let that ride, Jeff. Oh, yeah. Also, we had to give him the leader entrance, so he didn't have a generic entrance. There are parts where he looks very feminine, but it's as close as we're going to get to a Jeff Hardy entrance. Yes, sir, Jeff. Let's go. All right. I've been playing old other games. One, two. Make quick work of him. Make quick work of him. It only look like Bubba Ray. Oh, I was about to say, it didn't look like Bubba Ray gonna fight back. Uh uh. Nope. Them geriatric punches ain't gonna work on me. Not today. Hardy style. Too extreme. Oh, nobody home. Didn't quite get all of it. Get off me, man. Get off me, man. You're too slow. Yeah, Jeff. Okay, Bubba. We're pulling off some signature moves here. Getting some offense in, but that's the extent of as much offense as you're going to get. It's Jeff Hardy time, baby. Wow, that's the longest taunt I've ever seen in a video game ever. Jesus. Ooh, lucky for me, I got that perfect reverse timing. They said we want tables? Hey, we don't got none of those for you. Let him go, let him go, let him go, let him go. Build that damage up a little bit. Stop it. You know better than that, Bubba. You know better than that, Bubba. All right, all right. We're gonna make real quick work of this. Yes, sir. Twisted fate. 
Stay down for a second. Stay down for a second. I'm telling you, you're not gonna get no moves off of me, bub. I'm too goddamn quick. This ain't TNA Impact. I know how to play this game. Oh yeah. Whisper in the wind. Whisper in the wind. That means it's almost over. It's time, y'all. Here we go. That'll do it right there. Count it down, Hebner. You talk about a slow count, man. He about to get a twist of fate for my troubles. I'm just a slight bit confused as to how he has his smack down, shut your mouth, uh, win in motion. Let's go backstage and talk to Jericho. Let's see what Jericho got to say. Hey, jackass, I've got something to say to you. On second thought, I don't want to talk to a complete 100% grade A ass clown, so hit the bricks, Junior. Again, not on the show. What the freak, Vince McMahon? They're just not going to put me on the show. I lost a superstar point. So we are all ready to backlash, and I've had one match. You telling me creative sitting in the back right now for a 2003 prime Jeff Hardy telling him, I'm sorry, we just don't have anything for you right now. You telling me that's what's going on. We we not going to be on the card. Check it, bro. We not going to be on the card. There's no chance we're on the card. Stacey Keebler and Victoria for the women's title. Stacey Keebler is the women's champion. Very interesting. Wow. How did Stacey Keebler beat Victoria? How does that happen? Uh, Haas and Benjamin are going to take it. I, th I thought they would. And this one, I think Kurt Angle going to beat Tate. I think Kurt Angle going to beat Tate. Wow, Undertaker, your new WWE champion. Alrighty, oh, this is the part where they ask me, do I want to come? Do I want to go on the road for insurrection? Real quick, y'all, there's two matches missing from this video. The first being a triple threat match for the hardcore title versus Rob Van Dam and Raven, which I won. And the second one was pretty funny because it said that I was going to go backstage and talk to DDP. But in the middle of that conversation, Matt Hardy comes up and is mistaking DDP for Trish Stratus somehow. And we, me and him end up getting in a fight over Trish Stratus, who's actually DDP. And it was a hardcore match. It was pretty funny. But... Yeah, it got corrupted. So those two matches not all here. Moving on. All right, VD. He's trying to. I, I don't know if you just saw what I just did to my brother outside of the arena, but uh, I don't plan on doing no losing tonight. Two for two. That's what we gonna do for them Hardy boys. Neck breaker by Jeff Hardy. Little schoolboy, I'm I'm gonna go on Jeff Hardy moves and change them because uh, all these little these little sneak pins he got, that's cool and all, but I I want to be doing some Germans, yeah. So he, even with Jeff Hardy, I want Jeff Hardy out here doing Germans, dropping fools on the head. Get up, VD. Get up, VD. Get up, VD. There we go. Wow, he just... Yup. Mm-hmm. First DDT. And a low blow. Ref, you ain't gonna say nothing about that? Bet when I get a chair and knock his head off, I don't wanna hear nothing. Reversal. That's fine. I'm gonna reverse yours too. Stupid. Hold that. Okay. No? Well, hold that. Hardy boys! Two, three. The move that we beat. 
So many others with. So many others with. His hand hit the ring. I heard it. His hand hit the ring. I heard it. But I ain't gonna say nothing. Back up. Sorry, VD. They don't want to put me on the show, man. They not even booking me, bruh. They not even booking me. It's not, it's not, it's not personal. I just need to show them. Even their IC champion does not hold the candle to the charismatic enigma. Jeff, two-step party. I just love the way that move looks, even though it's probably very ineffective. I was about to say. <laughs> Uh-oh. RVP uh, trying to get some offense in. Trying to get his comeback going. Jeff Hardy says no. Jeff Hardy says no. Jeff Hardy stomping a mud hole. And even proceeding to walk it dry. Now it's time for you to have your twisted fate. Your face been twisted. And now it's time to end this. Come on, Jeff. Oh, I know. I know exactly what to do. I know exactly what to do. Exactly what to do. Now, this is a three count. Why? Why? You just let him up, Jeff. I saw you. I saw you move your legs. Why do you let him up? Oh, that's what I like to see right there. Close fist blows. Illegal strikes. My favorite kind. All right, man. Relax, VB. You think that head hurting now? Uh oh. Rob Van Dam come back in coming. Hey, the ref is giving Rob Van Dam every break he can. Sorry, Earl Hebner. He not winning this. This is for Jeff. Slow count, boy. It's time for a little whisper, ladies and gentlemen. And after you get that whisper, it's only one thing to do after that. Drop a bomb. Drop a bomb when you hear the whisper in the wind and get the win. Y'all started chatting that at the wrong time. Cause this one is over. Okay, immediately after my match, Eric Bischoff comes out. I guess I'm not really welcome here by this crowd. Well then, I'm gonna introduce you to your hometown hero. Oh, they about to beat up JR. Come on up to the ring, JR. I wanna give the fans what they want. You don't want to stand in ovation from your hometown, JR? All right, then. I'm going down there. Hey, he's coming over here. What the hell does he... Oh. <laughs> Eric Bischoff. Well, he I guess he do got a black belt. Let me shut up. Hey, stop it. Stop. Jeff, help. Yeah. Yeah, unless you want to twist the fate. On the stage, you better hit the bricks at Bischoff. So that's all I got for y'all. If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you drop a like. Make sure you drop a comment. Tell me what you like about this series if you want this to be a series. Or if this is, a, or if you want this to be a one-off. Let me know your opinions down below in the comments. So like I said, don't forget to leave that like. If you're new, subscribe to the channel. But as always, I'm D. Brown Shanghai. And I'm up out of here, man. Y'all boys be safe.